Our universe is vast and intricate and will most likely forever have hidden secrets yet to be discovered by any life form. It's no wonder why funding for space exploratory research will never stop, considering the never-ending territory of space and our fascination with wanting to know more and more about what's out there. Using a long list of extremely large and extremely little telescopes located across the globe, scientists have discovered numerous physics-defying planets across the last century, and the discoveries are only growing. While the main intention when using these telescopes is to find other habitable planets for Earth's many life forms in and out of our solar system, scientists have made shocking discoveries about some planets outside our solar system scientifically called exoplanets. They're called exoplanets because they don't orbit around a sun like the planets in our solar system do. Instead, they orbit around other stars. Some of these planets have truly mind-boggling environments that NASA's scientists are still trying to understand. So, let's take a look at four planets in particular that defy physics, starting off with a planet that everyone's talking about and has only recently been fully analyzed by scientists. WASP 18b The first of two newly understood hot Jupiter planets, WASP 18b, orbits incredibly close to its host star, circling just 1.4 million miles from its surface. From such a ringside seat, the planet's star-facing hemisphere broils at an estimated 3,800 degrees Fahrenheit. But why is it a mind-boggling planet? Much research into the planet was done by a team led by a professor of astrophysics at Keele University, Cole Hellier. According to Cole, with roughly 10 times the mass of Jupiter, it's hefty enough and close enough to raise a significant tidal bulge on the star. And because it orbits in just 22 and a half hours, faster than any other confirmed hot Jupiter and much faster than the star spins, this tidal interaction is possibly robbing WASP 18b of angular momentum. What this means is that the planet is being dragged inward towards its doom and fast. But it still stands to this day and will be with us for many more to come. Many scientists have begged the question, how does this planet even exist? The answers to this question have been varied, but there are a few possible explanations. Some feel that there's an undiscovered second planet in the mix whose gravitational tugs are preventing WASP-18b's demise. But a more likely explanation is that something's yet to be worked out with our understanding of how tidal energy dissipates within the star's interior. If it's a far more frictionless process than believed, then a planet like WASP-18b could hang in there for another billion years. WASP-121b The second newly analyzed hot Jupiter exoplanet that has people scratching their heads is WASP-121b. A team of astronomers observed the exoplanet using a spectroscopic camera aboard NASA's Hubble Space Telescope. The planet, at the center of a new study published on February the 21st, 2022, WASP-121b is a massive gas giant nearly twice the size of Jupiter. The planet is an ultra-hot Jupiter and was discovered in 2015 orbiting a star about 850 light-years from Earth. WASP-121b has one of the shortest orbits detected to date, circling its star in just 30 hours. It is also tidally locked meaning that its star-facing day side is permanently roasting, while its night side is turned forever towards space. This itself is unusual, if not rare, to find such a planet. But it was also discovered to be the first exoplanet to contain water in an extrasolar planetary stratosphere. On Earth, the water cycle exists in the following way. First, evaporating, then condensing into clouds, and finally raining out. On WASP-121b, the water cycle is far more intense. On the day side, the atoms that make up water are ripped apart at temperatures over 3,000 kelvins. 
These atoms are blown around to the night side, where colder temperatures allow hydrogen and oxygen atoms to recombine into water molecules, which then blow back to the day side, where the cycle starts again. It has also recently been discovered that water isn't circulating alone around the planet. Astronomers found that the night side is cold enough to host exotic clouds of iron and corundum, the latter of which is a mineral that makes up rubies and sapphires. These clouds, like water vapor, may whip around to the day side, where high temperatures vaporize the metals into gas form. On the way, exotic rain might be produced, such as liquid gems from the conundrum clouds. Strange but fascinating discoveries about an exoplanet that has forever changed the way astronomers observe exoplanets. Mystery Planets in GW Orionis Star System This triple star system has been slowly unfurling secrets for a while now. Right from the get-go, it's a strange star system. Here's what was initially confirmed about it in the 1940s. More than 1,300 light-years from Earth, there's a star system called GW Orionis. But in 1991, a group of fresh astronomers began to observe the star system further and suspected that there was more than one star in that system. It took another 20 years of study for astronomers to conclude there were three stars in GW Orionis and a protoplanetary disk surrounding all of them. That's when the discoveries began to really pile up and provide clarity as to just how strange GW Orionis is. Three star systems are uncommon, but not rare. NASA estimates that around 10% of the roughly 7 billion star systems in our galaxy have three stars. What is rare, however, is for a triple star system to also have protoplanetary disks. Things only got weirder from there. In 2017, Stefan Krauss, an astronomer at the University of Exeter in the United Kingdom, and his colleagues got a close look at GW Orionis using the Atacama Large Millimeter Array and the European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope, both in northern Chile. They found that the system's disks are misaligned and torn, publishing their findings in September 2020. A year later, a team led by Jeremy Smallwood at the University of Nevada published a study in monthly notices of the Royal Astronomical Society that tried, for the first time, to simulate GW Orionis's torn disks in order to explain them. What they think is happening is that at least one very massive planet is hiding somewhere in GW Orionis's rings. You heard that correctly a hidden planet in a mystery star system. If a planet were to actually be found in this star system, it would be the very first planet that we found in circumtriple orbits, meaning it circles around three stars, and this is highly likely to be the case. After further research by a team at the University of Victoria in Canada, it was estimated that out of all of GW Orionis's rings, the outermost ring, 31 billion miles from the center of the system, is the biggest protoplanetary disk ever recorded, with the same mass as 245 Earths, which makes it even more possible that multiple planets are waiting to be discovered within GW Orionis's star system. K2141b in a new study announced on November 3, 2020, an international team of researchers described a planet unlike any other in our solar system. The Earth-sized exoplanet named K2141b is a hot lava world on one side, but extremely cold on the other. While this feature is similar to WASP-121b, it is far, far more divided between hot and cold temperatures. K2141b has a magma ocean, a rock vapor atmosphere, and supersonic winds. It's one of two planets in a star system about 202 light years from our solar system in the direction of Aquarius, the water bearer, a constellation seen from all parts of the world on November evenings. Planets that orbit close to their stars tend, of course, 
to be a lot hotter than those that are farther away. For example, Mercury and Venus in our solar system. But in some solar systems, there are planets that orbit their stars even closer than Mercury, the closest planet to our Sun. Some of these extreme worlds, such as K2141b, are referred to as lava planets, where scientists think that at least part of the surfaces is covered by molten magma oceans. This is the type of Earth-defying exoplanets that are best kept away from our solar system for as long as life exists on Earth.